Plank sections in bending at ultimate limit states. The beam with flan in compressions, which can exist in the form of T or L sections, can be designed in a similar manner as per a typical rectangular section based on the stress block diagram. The flan is referring to the extruded part from a typical reinforced concrete beam. It is normally due to the slab which is monolithically connected to the beam and the slab can be taken as a part of the beam in resisting the load. As the flame provide a large compressive area, the compression steel is normally not required. Therefore, a typical flame section is designed as a singly reinforced section. For a singly reinforced section, there are two possible conditions where the stress block lies within the compressive flange as indicated here. And this is the stress block and the height of the stress block here S is within the height of the flange. The other possible conditions is the stress block extend below the flange. This means that the height of the stress block here is exceeding the height of the flan and penetrate into the part of the web of the flan section. With that, we can typically term this situation as S less than HF, while this situation as S is more than HF. It is noted that the S here is equals to 0 0.8 times the x here. It is not necessary that the x has to be always less than the hf. The positions of the neutral axis may exceed slightly the height of the hf as long as the s here, the height of the stress block, are within the hf. Due to the differences between the stress block here, the calculations of the bending strength for the flank sections under different conditions differ slightly. This will be discussed in the following videos.